It is just about Passover, and before you shop for the week, Chef Cindy Avila is here with some Passover must-haves. Good morning. Good to be here. Uh, yeah, good to see you again. And this is interesting. We were talking about how food has changed so much. I think there's more options exactly. now. Exactly. And certainly people, you know, celebrating and acknowledging Passover. There's most stores now I've noticed having like an entire aisle or an entire setup for Passover, which uh -huh. makes it a lot easier to shop for Passover. But then um, it's nice to have some experts kind of point us in the yes, right direction as you well. Still, <laughs> you still need some, some direction there. So the star always for me is the matzah. Everybody loves matzah uh -huh. during Passover because you can't have any flour that rises. Okay. That's like one of the biggest rules of Passover. So my, my favorite is Yehuda matzah. It's imported from Israel and it's gluten free. So the whole family and guests can enjoy it. Yehuda also comes in several different flavors, which is unique for matzah. We used to only have one choice when, when it came to, to flavors. Yes, but this is these. great. There's actually an everything flavor, kind of like an everything bagel type of flavor and a sweet cinnamon flavor, which can be eaten alone or to make a great matzo brai. Matzo brai is kind of like the matzo French toast kind of thing that okay. you make for breakfast. Um, and I also send in matzo in my children's lunch boxes the week of Passover with a little bit of butter on it and they love it. Um, so there's so much to do with it and that's Yehuda matzo. Look for it and stock up on all the different flavors. Is um, this really at excited. kind of your traditional grocery store? Yes. Yep. You can find right. it where, wherever okay. Passover products are sold. Okay. Perfect. And then this is this is unique for Passover and new. Like you said, there used to not be a lot of options. Yeah. These are sea castle roasted sea seaweed snacks, which mm -hmm. my husband and daughter are addicted mm -hmm. to seaweed snacks, so they're so excited about this. It's the first and only kosher for Passover seaweed snacks, mm -hmm. so the, it's organic, gluten-free, vegan and dairy free and only 20 calories per serving so it's great to throw in your bag for an anytime snack or put in your lunchbox you can also crumble it up and put it on a salad to add a good crunch and to add you oh, know some healthy idea. elements yes and see uh sea castle seaweed snacks come in sea salt or spicy say so that 10 times spice fast yeah <laughs> <laughs> so i love those okay and then during passover you usually have to forego pasta dishes and i love pasta and you don't want to do that for, do. for yeah. a whole week it's it's you know nice now to be able to enjoy pasta during Passover. So Geffen lasagna is a product never seen before for Passover. You can create amazing gluten-free lasagna dishes for dairy or meat um, for the Seder and all throughout Passover. Geffen is one of the most recognizable kosher brands and it's best known for its commitment to quality and a well-respected kosher certification. So enjoy your lasagna okay, this Passover. Yeah. Super excited about that. And then um, Another great one is rice cauliflower. This is actually a big trend right now in general. That's um, some of these things that you can have all year round. Exactly. So this is a trend, but you can't have rice during Passover usually. So this is so fabulous that um, now there's heaven and earth frozen rice cauliflower. It's amazing. And like I said, if you haven't tried rice cauliflower before, run, don't walk. Okay. Use it wherever you use rice normally. Um, it's, I think kids will like this too. Yes. And, you can sneak veggies in yep, there, but uh -huh. you don't even need to tell them. It. Just tell them it's <laughs> rice. Um, it's actually Google listed rice cauliflower as one of the rising stars. Um, and heaven and earth is organic, low carb, and gluten free. And it's great in dishes year round, but especially during Passover. And I would love to saute that up with yep. whatever you want, really. You can and again, kinda... you can see this a lot of the, the major grocery stores as well. Absolutely, in your frozen section. Okay, yes. good to know. Well, thank you so much again thank for you. coming in. We always look forward to, to seeing Passover. what you bring in, what you, uh, <laughs> which you know is tried and true and well liked. For, for more information, there's a website too, right? That people can check you out and see what you're yep. doing. My website is nomeatnoproblem.com. All right. Sounds good. Thanks, Chef. Thank you.